Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Let's Play Hearts of Man 4, Kai's Dragons, Paul, Lithuania. Let's continue on from where we last left off. So, we pushed up a decent amount up the Italian boot. We've done a nice landing in France. Probably going to actually bring troops away from the northern front. So, hopefully allowing Germany to maybe make some decent push somewhere. I mean, that's the hope, at least. We're going to land our entire 24 stack into Nice. Is that dangerous? Probably just because of the sheer amount of men we're landing and hopefully the I mean this is a decent port right is it uh again I cannot I cannot click the province um so we're gonna send our cavalry straight up to Turin that was our initial goal or at least our initial plan I should say and it should work out decently enough I mean there's a chance that our tank divisions can get that done on their own as well Okay, so like these two groups, send them into these battles. Yeah, some guys got to just kind of reposition themselves. Keep moving down this coastline. It looks like you're trying to maybe get your way towards Turin. I'm not too, too sure. We can already basically unify these front lines anyway, so that's not a problem for us. You're going to march in this direction. This nice remaining uh, militia can just kind of march its way up north. We have been losing some convoys. Don't go this way then. How are supplies looking, by the way? Like, are they fine? Um, mostly. They could be better, but they also could be hell of a lot worse. Okay, go take Marseille. And this Hungarian division, you come help assist in this invasion. We did lose Genoa, which is a bit of a shame, because we would like to take that back, of course. Because we also probably need, we probably just can't only take Turin. I imagine there's going to be some other cities that they, uh, I need to take to get rid of the capitulation for sure. Yeah, and this invasion of France going pretty well, I would say. Um, yeah, I think Turin might just be slightly out of our uh, reach, at least for this exact moment in time. Which is a real shame. Yeah, because they're definitely defending that. More than I would like them to, for sure. France really isn't even trying to defend the southern border, like, at all. Maybe they're still more scared of the Germans, which is understandable. I would be, I would be too, than, you know, Poland attacking in the south. But still... Not even like a, a four men, then just what two? One of them being a tank that has like no strength. Seems like that might prove to be an issue for you at some point in the future, but what do I know? So tanks are going good. Is there anything we actually need? The answer is support equipment. So yeah, let's let's make even more of that. Because like we could put some. Are these other divisions in here? We'll probably take this city. You're gonna get getting multiple combat penalties, too, so we should be able to push our way into there. Yes, so we have taken you. Push on to Bologna. Definitely not how you say it. Is it better than the... No, I still don't really know. Wait, why did this territory go to... Two Sicilies? Excuse me? I'm assuming because Germany... I thought Two Sicilies doesn't exist anymore. No, it's part of the Entente. I'm assuming Germany has military access. Yeah, good, good work, idiot.
Okay, so we have taken another major city off of you. Try to push our way in this direction. Can you go to here? You can. So you're going to now push here. I mean, Antonin Division is now going to go to this province. And we can see some troops from Argentina have arrived. So it, it took a while, but the French have finally decided to kind of respond to the invasion of the south. I mean, it took them long enough. You think you would have done that a lot earlier, but, you know. No judgment here, I guess. We need to push here, and then you push your way into Modena. Like, I would like the Italian Republic to do something. Is this, this is not Cord. Oh, Italy has... Oh. We didn't even need to take Turin. Or Torino, I guess. Well, that actually worked out significantly better than I had originally anticipated. So... Blue Army and then the Tank Army, please make your way over here. Like ASAP. Of course, these guys can still uh, kill these little guys off, but you should still be fine. No, you're still here, please. You can you can stay back. Yeah, so France is gonna take back Sicily. Please kill these guys off. So that should already be this dealt with. I'm really surprised that just taking these handful of northern cities was enough. I definitely thought there'd be at least like a little bit more than needed to be done. Oh, we're going here. What are you doing? Thank you very much. But now that we're out of the, the goddamn mountains, the tank divisions can really start to shine, I think. If you go down to here, we can probably use our tanks to push our way straight across. By the way, King Spain, did you decide? You want to be stand alone. I think I knew that already, but... I'm still disappointed by the results. Okay, so blue line's gonna stretch your way out to over here. But France by themselves definitely cannot withstand us. How is Japan looking? Very stagnant. Fantastic. I'm still... I'm just... Not too sure what the hell we're going to do with Japan. Okay, so now that blue army is arriving, we can shrink down the red line. And you know what we can probably do? We're going to have red be our main assault force while blue is kind of just defending uh, the back lines here. Because the tanks are fast. It's one of the things we like here. It's things to move fast. Keep sending our armor all around. We get some nice encirclement if we try hard enough. Yeah, we got better logistics companies, even though I don't believe I have any logistic companies in my army quite yet. Where's them? You know what? Probably want the anti-tank rifles. Make them a little bit better for us. And we got reform the high command, so we can actually finally get all of our um, doctrines. Yeah, purple, your job is basically going to be to spearhead your way to here. I don't know why these arrows are so goddamn big. I feel like they've gotten larger. I know that isn't true at all, but it feels like a very large arrow. At least get some planning bonuses here going. And yeah, get an extra research slot. 
You know, that's why we're in the neighborhood, right? Okay. So I still, I still can't help but notice that the Germans haven't done anything in the north. I know that's where most of the French army is, but still, you know, you think they would be just even slightly better. Like, France right now is at 80% capitulation. I've done 31% of the war. Germany... I mean, I've done more than Germany, for sure. Am I the one who's done the most? Yeah, for once, this game recognizes that I'm actually the person contributing the most to the war effort. It's a rare, uh, it's a rare sight, indeed. For them to actually recognize that as a fact. Yeah, please send my super fast tanks around. Please and thank you. Uh, you know what? You actually stay still. 63-0. So this light or this medium tank, please stop the attack at least for the moment. We could try to land in Bordeaux. You know what? Stretch blue line out more. And four pins are beginning to kind of pour in. Federation of the War on the Commune, that is A-OK. -okay. Shouldn't need to worry about what's happening in India. Oh, we're actually going to take a Bordeaux. Lovely, lovely, lovely. A nice city to kind of have under our control. Surprised having so okay, you, you can maybe push your way to like Dunkirk if you can get that accomplished. That seems pretty good. I only have low supply here. That's not surprising. I mean, the AI is throwing everything they have to try to stop you or to stop, try to stop the Japanese, right? There's no way any of these attacks I think would work. Might as well get like try once, but I think overall it's not going to be nearly enough. We have 18,000, or no, we have 10,000 artillery. Probably don't need that many, so cut this in half. Yeah, so our front line is looking pretty, pretty nice. You should fall back soon. And we got our final artillery upgrade, lovely. So now we can actually get the rest of our doctrines. They should research. Yeah, 116 days is not too bad for a nice technology. I'm trying to think, like, what? One, if the Entente helped us, that would definitely do something. Like, if we can get, like, a naval invasion in the north to work. That would be nice. I don't know if a naval invasion in the north could work, unfortunately. Enforcement sending reinforcements to try to stop me killing them. A very disappointing turn of events, but you know, what can you do? Like, if anything, we probably want, like, another naval invasion to work. Hungary. Give me all your men. Romania, are you part of the... F you're part of the faction. You are my puppet state. Um, you have three troops. You are German, so I can't request forces from you. Russia, what about you? How many men do you have? 
You have 33. What is 7? So that's 20. 17. So all of these new troops are going to immediately prepare for an invasion of France. Well, I guess another invasion of France to be more, more specific. But anybody, also you can be, let's say, the uh, Orange Army. Anybody who's not in an army is going to immediately join up with uh, these troops. The army tab, that's what I'm looking for. So all of you guys unassigned. Some of you guys are in combat, that is fine. You're all now part of Orange. I don't even know where the hell you guys are. You're all on the front line with Japan, huh? Gonna be more. I mean, Romania has three troops that are a little bit closer. They have two troops, I should say. So send them here. We don't. Yeah, we have two of you guys. I guess just hang out with Green. I mean, what about the other guys? Are you my puppet state? I don't remember. You are. Georgia is a puppet state. You guys are significantly closer. And you're not even involved in the war at all. Actually, you're not supposed to be. You're supposed to go to this army. Send them over. Now we have many on this front, huh? That's fine, kind of. Uh, you can also deploy here. And then we basically just are going to be uh, getting another naval invasion ready to go. I don't, how long is it going to take for you guys to get here, though? The Church of Hungary is actually not going to take that long. It is everybody else who's going to prove to be an issue. From Bordeaux up to Brest. Get that invasion ready to go. I'm going to send my, my uh, ships to Bordeaux because I don't know... If these troops, if these uh, port they have troops in them. What we do know is that we do have naval supremacy, at least in the Bay of Biscay. Which is good for us. We have a lot of troops coming in. You're going to be here much faster than... Uh... Like these guys, for example, delete them. Get you down to 31. We got two troops here. Just delete those. Again, they're not getting deleted. They're just going back to the uh, AI's control. You are going to take way too long to get anywhere. And I guess, like, these militias as well. We can kind of make sure they can just kind of stay at home. There we go. So we got a nice 24 stack. I mean, I guess we could have sent one of them into Blue Army, but you know, I'm not going to worry about that too much. One of them's actually, some of them are actually coming through the channel. I mean, you can do that if you want. I'm not going to stop you. Be part of the Red Army. How many? How much supplies? 29 out of 15, huh? I honestly, I don't care if you don't want to do it. Like, I'm going to make you do it anyways. The problem is, again, like, if the Italian Republic was just in the Reich's Pact, I think our supply lines would be much better, because right now we do have the ship supplies. I mean, it's not that bad. Wait, where's the bottleneck here? The Port of Nice. 20. Oh, are you, are you kind of figuring out what you're trying to do? I hope so. so. Who's actually in the name? You guys are actually the ones doing the invasion. Understandable. But eventually, you. Okay, it looks like they do have troops in Brest.
Why are you around going around South Africa? We might not be allowed to pass through Gibraltar, even though I think we got through Gibraltar the first time, didn't we? I believe so, but it looks like... I guess we can use some of these militias to kind of see. The breast is defended. You're defended. La Rochelle isn't? We could theoretically use that as a... A place to strike from? Or to strike into, but... Striking into La Rochelle probably is like not the best use of our resources. Actually, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna send you back to, uh, say Germany. Just so I can see these other ports. Okay, I got troops here. I mean, France has way more troops than the, the Italians did, so it makes sense that all these ports are gonna probably be defended. You're not. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Uh, do, do, do. Orange Army then. You're gonna go here. Do we have any do we have already over the English Channel? No, we have 26%. So maybe that's why the AI is not too worried about actually securing the the ports in that area. Maybe. Can't do it yet because we don't have enough superiority. We're, what are, where are aircraft? Like, what are they doing? They're still in Italy, huh? Send them over the channel. Maybe that can get something good done for us. I'm not too, too sure. Yes, we got some enemy sh uh, aircraft, but it's mostly... Okay, we're at 43% now. Air superiority is at 78%. Oh, it's just, it's just continually rising. What we probably actually want to do is get Orange Army just ready to invade. So that the moment it goes over the... Uh... Okay, so the people actually sent to... Do the invasion are not there yet. So, you know what? Send in these two militias. To do the invasion because they're already in the port. Only 33%. I believe in us. Given enough time, we should be able to, you know, win this out. Also, what does resist resistance target minus 5%? You know, let's get that done now. But I don't think most of the other. It's literally the only ship you can make. I don't think most of the other focuses I, I like I don't really care about too much anymore. The Anton is slowly pushing her way into Portugal, but I just don't know how many troops the, the International kept in Portugal. They might have all left. Um, so let's just keep on improving our Air Force. 69 days, nice. But I think after a pretty successful invasion of southern France that this is going to be a good time for us to end this episode. So thanks everybody for watching. My name is Anthem. If you enjoyed, give a thumbs up. Not enjoy, close thumbs down. If you want to see more, subscribe. And goodbye.